I would like to start highlighting that uh, uh, woman is particularly important in Africa. Uh, and uh, uh, particularly important in the fight against poverty, hunger, and all forms of malnutrition. In fact, in Africa, woman is responsible for most of the agricultural activities, also for the control of the herds, feed the children, and uh, small trade. Uh, we need uh, to better recognize this role of women, particularly on food security and nutrition. Uh, and this includes better representation in governance mechanisms and decision-making processes. I think that that is the key issue that we are lucky we are. Empower women means uh, recognizing uh, the need of uh, better representation of women in all decision-making process. We, uh, I would like uh, to say that we have a joint program named Accelerating Progress Towards the Economic Empower of Women with WFP, IFAD, and we, uh, uh, UN Women. And this program has already enabled more than 40,000 women to receive training and uh, improve use of uh, new technologies and also enhance access to financial service and market. We believe that uh, access to land, financial service are key issues in empowering women. One of the uh, good things we are doing also is to uh, give training and capacity building for women to have uh, their own uh, enterprise. And we are doing that, for example, in Gambia, also in Rwanda, with poultry. And uh, we could see the uh, reflect that reflect not only on uh, nutrition issues but also on earnings of the family with this small business uh, when women had it. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to highlight that uh, uh, FAO was <coughs> commended by UN women recently for achieving or exceeding more than 90% of all UN swap performance indicators. We are among of the uh, leading agents in the UN system that comply with the action plan on gender equality and empowerment of women. So uh, I have to say that uh, uh, in considering only international posts, women represent now more than 40%. And if we consider all posts, women represent more than 55%. So as the majority of the employees of FIO in this moment are women. Uh, I would like also to say that uh, after our region conference, uh, the first semester in Africa, we uh, uh, started a regional outlook on gender and agro-food systems uh, in, in uh, partnership with uh, African Union. And uh, this uh, assessment made showed that we need uh, to place gender target <coughs> problems that address specific vulnerabilities uh, on household nutrition and resilience as the two more important things to improve in our work in Africa. Let me repeat it. Household nutrition and resilience. You may know that uh, one of the surprise, not good surprise, of our last SOFI, that is the report of FAO, on food security around the world, 
was that the hunger numbers are increasing, and increasing more in Africa than in other regions. But uh, a surprise even worse than that is that obesity is increasing, and increasing more in Africa than in all other regions of the world. In fact, the eight out of the 20 faster uh, growing countries in obesity rates are in Africa nowadays. So this issue of nutrition also is very important to address. I would like to conclude saying that uh, we do believe that uh, is the momentum for uh, promote gender equality and women's empowerment, not only in Africa, but especially in Africa. We need to pursue it, this goal, particularly in Africa, due to the importance of the role of women plays in all sectors in Africa. I thank you for your presence and for this opportunity. Thank you.